Now here we have an iterative formula and in this we're given the first approximation x0 is 1.43 and we're asked to find the next three approximations to the root alpha x1, x2 and x3 giving our answers to four decimal places. So how do we do this? Well to get x1 what I've got to do is let n equal 0. Why? Because this will be x0 plus 1, in other words x1, and it will equal the square root of 2 over x0. So we'll just put that in, 2 over x0, and we know that x0 is 1.43. And then plus the 2 thirds on the end here. Let's put that in brackets. And if you work that out on your calculator, what you should find is that you get 1.43710 and so on. So giving this to four decimal places, we end up with 1.4371 to 4dp. And if I want the next approximation, x2, then I just let n equal 1. And when n equals 1, you have x1 add 1, that's x2, equals the square root of 2 over x1. And x1 we know is 1.43710 and so on. And then plus 2 thirds. And again, if you work this out on your calculator, what you should find is you get 1.434. 6, 9, and so on. And when this is rounded to four decimal places, it's just 1.4347 to 4dp. And again, if you were to let n equal 2, you'd find you could work out what x3 was, just simply by doing 2 divided by this value here, plus 2 thirds, and taking the square root of the lot. OK, I'm not going to set the working out for this one, but if you do do it, you should find that you get 1.43551 and so on. So to four decimal places, that's 1.4355 to 4dp. OK, and that brings us to the end then of this particular part of the question.